Here's an update on what's happening at the city of Lakeville. A new highly anticipated restaurant has recently opened in town. Barley and Vine, located in the former Copper River building, held a ribbon cutting ceremony to celebrate the occasion. The restaurant is located at the southeast corner of Cedar Avenue and Dodd Boulevard. Work continues on the new water tower. Assembly of the tank has started with the construction of its lower portion. Once completed, the tank will be lifted to the top of the structure, which will occur sometime this spring. The tower is scheduled to be placed into service this fall. On Saturday, February 6th, area youth are invited to fish through one of the many holes cut through Valley Lake at the 16th Annual Youth Fishing Contest. Participants need to bring their own fishing equipment and bait, but volunteers from Lakeville's Knights of Columbus will take care of drilling holes in the ice. This free event starts at noon and lasts till 2 p.m., with prizes awarded to kids ages 13 and younger. Also on Saturday, February 6th, the Lakeville Area Arts Center will be hosting a pre-Valentine's Day celebration with the George Mauer Jazz Group. You'll enjoy jazzy twists on your favorite romantic classics while indulging in decadent chocolate desserts and champagne. The band's unique style and witty on-stage banter have earned them rave reviews throughout the Midwest. Choose from theater seating or candlelit tables for two. Tickets are available at lakevilleareaartcenter.com. And finally, members from the city's fleet maintenance and fire department recently checked out the two new fire trucks that are being built for LFD. The new trucks are a combination of a rescue and pumper, and they will take the place of three older trucks in the fleet. The manufacturer is planning to have the trucks delivered this spring. If you would like more information about these or other city-related items, visit the city's website at lakevillemn.gov or call 952 985-4400. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. And now you're caught up on what's happening here at the city of Lakeville.